A garage in Mogadishu is a place of renewal for Somalia's art scene. Here at the Center for Research and Dialogue, artists who kept their talents hidden during more than two decades of war are beginning to reemerge. One of the most prolific is Adan Farah Afe, who discovered painting as a child in a Catholic orphanage in the city. The nuns admired my work and would bring me paintbrushes and tell me to paint for them. And when I had a better understanding of my skills, I noticed I was better than the other kids. Now, given a chance to express himself, there is no topic Afe is afraid of. This painting shows the terror wrought by the Islamist militant group Al-Shabaab, represented as a serpentine beard burned into the canvas. Afi takes his inspiration from the world around him, a country overcoming years of war. He blames many of Somalia's troubles on a broken political system. We don't have any natural disasters. We don't have tornadoes, tsunamis, or Hurricane Katrina. Our disasters are all political. The work of several artists is on display in an upstairs gallery, much of it expressing the personal experiences of war and the struggle of the working artist. Project manager Mohamed Yaya says the center is working to give the artists wider exposure. Um, some of them are being taken um, to Europe, some of them are being taken to America for, um, for showing the pieces um, as an exhibition. So we are hoping to get New York or, uh, or Los Angeles in the next stages to push these artists to the next level. As the artists come out of the shadows of war and into a new era of hope, it is their dream to one day show the world a portrait of a new Somalia. Gabe Joslow, VOA News, Mogadishu.